Hey, Physique Freaks, how's it going? Scott Tuzana, MetabolicMasterpiece.com, here with the progress update, eight weeks into this cutting phase, weighing in at 148 pounds, right on. That is down 11 pounds in eight weeks, and this week, it was only half a pound. Up to this point, I've been dropping about 1.4 pounds per week, and this was the slowest week of progress, which totally makes sense up to this point. I don't have a lot of fat left to burn off of my physique. It's all that last little bit is going to be mainly the love handles and lower back fat, and I just got a tiny little pocket of lower belly fat right now. So even in this front relaxed pose, you're seeing more details and the serratus popping out there just in front of the lats, uh, the obliques cutting down, seeing more of that. Uh, the quads are looking a little more sliced. The upper and mid abs are looking more detailed. Uh, lower abs, I'm starting to see a little bit more detail in that line. I'm pointing out my obliques right there. You see them cutting down. They were starting to make an appearance last week, and this week they're becoming more and more obvious. Really loving this process. Um, I'm thinking I probably got about three more pounds to go, two to three more pounds, and that'll be it. So. Uh, my plan was to push it one more week leading up to, uh, we have a, a little weekend getaway coming up. We're going to be hanging around the pool in the hot tub, and I want it to look really freaking awesome. Um, we'll see. I may continue pushing it just for a little bit longer, just because I'm freaking, I am loving this process. I feel incredible. My energy is sky high. I've never been more fascinated with my physique. Loving all the details I'm seeing. No plans on competing or anything just yet. Uh, it may even be a while before I ever step on stage. Just thinking about doing it this year, but still need to put on more size for uh, before I step on stage. So who knows? I'm not going to step on stage till I really feel like I want to do it in a big way. Just dropping my hands there, seeing more details carved out. The obliques and abs, loving the shoulders. Even there, my triceps are striated when I'm I'm not even flexing them they're extended happy with how the uh, hamstrings look there quads are I mean uh, calves are okay definitely uh, still need the work loving the back and uh, seeing some veinage there we go more veinage running across the traps they were making a little bit of an appearance last week too uh, but even more detailed today so Upper back, again, a little more carved out. Lower back, definitely. I'm seeing more striations. Starting to see the spinal erector starting to come through. So that Christmas tree should be popping out in time for Christmas, <laughs> which would be freaking awesome. Absolutely loving it. Uh, as I said, I'm just freaking, I'm loving this process. It's feeling really good. Uh, some people have asked me, like, why I'm taking it to the next level. And a lot of it is just... It's comfort. Like right now, where I'm at right now, this is this is my happy point. I am freaking loving this. I love the way I look. I love the way I feel, and um, this is where I am. I'm connect. This is where my my standards are, and this is I'd say from here on out, I'm not going to let myself gain any more fat beyond where I'm at at this point. So it's definitely going to be lean gains. I'm going to be staying within uh, three pounds of my striking distance. So if I ever do feel like I want to compete, I know. It's going to be a short, short cutting phase uh, in order for myself to get on stage. I'm <clears throat> probably going to end up doing some photo shoots and stuff like that before I compete. Um, we'll just see how things are going. Loving the way, like even just relaxed there, seeing a hell of a lot more detail. This is my favorite pose right now. I love it. The triceps are popping out. You see that split across my biceps. My waist is looking small. Obliques are carved out. And... Um, chest is looking okay like compared to the past um, usually when I'm getting this lean my chest is is pretty flat like really really flat um, it's not my best attribute that's for sure but there's an improvement there lower abs more carved out I was actually starting to see some veins in front of the bathroom mirror uh, starting to come up from my lower abs so that uh, that's exciting the heck out of me let me know that I'm pretty darn close it's gonna be interesting to see how much longer it's going to take me to to get this last little bit off. It is the holidays, so uh, I will be enjoying myself. This pose is making my waist look really, really tiny, even compared to last week. So not much left there. Really, really happy. Even though the scale didn't drop much, the visual changes are definitely enough to get me uh, just completely stoked. And here's Rick. 
getting ready to head out to Cuba on this day. So we did our workout, did our posing, and then he was getting ready to hop on that plane and head off to Cuba. Quads looking all nice and sliced. And he's looking nice and full. That's a great, he's like the oblique detail there. The abs are kind of carved out there. Really getting him to stand a little more upright, to pull that skin nice and tight. And so he's kind of found, he's starting to find some nice poses that really show off his physique a lot better and uh, kind of takes away from that loose skin in the lower belly area. I love those kind of shots where he's just pulling that arm back a bit, standing nice and tall and upright. His chest looks great and full there. Details in the shoulders and arms. Just freaking awesome. 52. He's going to be 53 in a month and a half. So like six weeks, 53 years old. Just in the best shape of his life. Look at the freaking thighs there. I love the details carved out of his legs. Like all the way up from calves all the way up to his glutes. He's sliced. The obliques coming in there. That's a great shot. Just awesome. And for him, like I'm really taking a lesson out of his book because he has been within like three to five pounds of striking distance of this weight. He's weighing in about 164, 165, and uh, he doesn't let himself get above 170 for the past three years. So um, his first cut we did together as he was approaching his 50th birthday a few years ago. And uh, from that point on, he's been keeping his weight under 170. So always freaking lean and shredded and uh, just uh, building up, just adding, strategically adding some muscle in the right places, and he's done a hell of a job of it. It's, it's fun. After 35 plus years of training, to still, still see him building his physique and shaping it and um, just loving the freaking process. So here we go, the back shot. This is, this is just the best. We love it. We kind of use this as, as his gauge of how shredded he is because there's just... There's no fat on his back. You're just seeing striations all over the place. Lots of details in those shoulders and upper back. Even that, that lower back, I mean, he's, he's just not carrying anything there at all. Looking phenomenal. Crazy inspiring. Love seeing this. Love seeing all the muscles twitching. And it just it excites us, not just when we're posing, but when we're working out to see those muscles twitching like crazy, see them in action, see all the details carved out. We just, we freaking love, we love it. This is, we're just hooked on this lifestyle, fascinated with the potential of the human body. Look at the triceps popping out. Everything's popping out there. What a guy. Feel very grateful to have uh, an incredible workout partner like this who loves to kind of test his limits and, and just continuing to strive for his potential. Now, have you noticed, as you notice, we've been keeping this footage completely raw and lighting. So we're looking, I told him to look at the lighting, not seeing the bicep split. He's going to take half a step forward. Then all of a sudden the bicep splits pop out. So just want to show you this, like no camera tricks. I'm not just showing the good, the best parts of our physique. We're showing it all. Hope you enjoy this footage. Catch you next week.